Okay, so I got a question, and I can't remember from who, but essentially the question was, yo, Sparty, I just recently got blocked, and we weren't even dating. Can you explain the reason to me why? Okay, so here's the deal. I'm going to make this a super quick video. Um, there's one of three reasons. One, two, three reasons why you got blocked. And the first reason, and this is probably the most likely reason, and I don't know the background or anything, but generically speaking, right? Um, the most likely reason that you got blocked is probably because you just came on way too strong, okay? You just came on way too strong where you're hitting this person up every day. Um, they were making excuses not to see you. You kept hitting them up. You double texted them. You Snapchatted them a lot. You were super quick to text them back, okay? And you just didn't, you didn't create enough space between you guys early on. And when you're pressing early on in the relationship and you don't get the hint and you don't have the awareness that this person needs a little bit of space by block block okay so that would be the first reason again always be aware of where you sit in the relationship if you are aware okay you're aware this won't happen to you you won't come off too strong you want it so the other party okay that chick is reaching out to you close to 100% of the time, 90 to 100% of the time. Because if not, and you're pushy, pushy, pushy on a daily basis, you're getting blocked, buddy. You just are. Number two, okay? The second possible reason, okay? And this is a little less likely, but highly possible. This chick was talking to another dude that she liked a little more than you. Or she had a boyfriend, and you just didn't know about it, okay? And... She, if she has a boyfriend or she's talking and she's really hot and heavy with another dude and you maybe came in a little late to the picture, she's just going to pick the other guy over you. And, um, or she just doesn't want the other guy to know. So any hints, any indications, like you reaching out to her on, uh, three o'clock on a Saturday night to hang out while she's with this guy snuggling in bed, it's not going to work out. Okay. So she's going to block you just plain and simple. And again, it's not your fault. You didn't know she had a boyfriend. And, um, you know, if she has a boyfriend, she probably doesn't want to give off any indications that she cheated or was cheating. And trust me, dude, if you were hooking up with that girl who had a boyfriend, it's not worth it because she's going to do the same shit to you. It's just going to happen eventually. Okay. So until she learns her lesson, not worth it. So it's better that she blocked you. And the third, okay, the third and final instance on why you got blocked is... Plain and simple, she lost feelings and she didn't want to have that conversation with you, okay? She didn't have the heart and the strength and the power to just sit you down or text you and just say, hey, I don't like you like that. I don't like you like that, okay? And quite frankly, you shouldn't want that chick in your life. You should want a girl who's honest. If you guys have been hanging out and you've been sitting, getting dinners and shit or hanging out five, ten plus times, and she can't have the honest conversation when you reach out to her and say, hey, what are you up to this weekend? Do you want to hang out? And she can't sit you down and just say, hey, listen, you know, I'm, I'm really, I don't think it's going to work out between us. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. It's one thing to kind of fade away and, you know, eventually you get the hint, but if you block her and then, or if she blocks you and she blocks you on Instagram and Facebook and Snapchat and all this shit, it's just because she's avoiding trying to have a difficult conversation. And she has some shit that she needs to work on, okay? And if she can't have that honesty with you, not worth your fucking time, dude. It's, it's better for you. Move on, pa go past it, find someone better. Plain and simple. It's not that fucking hard.